Rolling with the Robots. Buford High School is hosting its Rumble in the Nest, a regional VEX tournament. More than 60 Middleland High School robotics teams from across the state are competing, including teams of students from seven of our district schools. For the high school competition, teams are randomly assigned partners and they work together, scoring points for the challenge. So you score points by getting these green colored tri balls either under a goal or into your alliance zone. You have a blue side and a red side. The blue team gets points whenever they have tri balls just in the open area, that's two points each. And when you get them under the blue goal for the blue team, they get five points each. Teams get creative when designing and building their robots, and the students also use several different strategies when competing. We made ours entirely short to fit under the goal, so that way when everybody else is doing elevation at the end, we can just go under and sweep all their points out. We just have a rotating gear that sucks the balls in, and then we can take them to our um, net and then shove them back under. And then we just have an arm that can come out and like hit them like a baseball bat kind of into the goal. So basically just scoring in the goal, and if we need to, we can push it. Our strategy went competing is so we have the robot on the bar and we have this flywheel on top of it uh, that shoots out the tri balls so while the robot is touching it we load the tri balls and shoot them out into one spot we do that for like 30 seconds once the 30 seconds is up we control the robot to have it push all of the balls to the other side and we try to put all those tri balls under the net we use a catapult to load the tri balls and then launch them to the other side of the field to get us points and then we either drive over or get our alliance partner to push them under the goal or we'll just drive over and push them under the goal ourselves. For the middle school challenge, teams can score points several different ways. So you score points by picking up the green blocks and shooting them in the goal or hitting off the reds and parking. During the competition, members of the team must also take turns controlling the robot. So our strategy is that she starts gets four blocks, dumps that, and then I go and get the other two, dump them into two goals, two for each goal. She'll hit off the red, and then I'll go and hit off the other two reds in park. So the first 30 seconds, we're gonna try to knock down the red blocks and try to get like a, maybe like a few, like 10 to 15 points. And then our second partner's try to gonna get some more points. And if they cannot, we'll just partially park to get a little bit more. Our strategy is that I would take all the time, basically I go to 25 seconds and then I'll try to get all the green blocks in into the red pedestals. And then my partner will knock off all the red blocks and then go partially park. Both middle and high school teams that do well will qualify for the state VEX championships in February. At Buford High School, Ron Lopes, Buford County School District.